カカロット貴様は手を出すなあの程度俺様一人で十分だベジータのやつ気合い入ってんな俺らも負けてらんねえ全宇宙一であるこの僕が君たちに地獄以上の恐怖を見せてあげるよ Hi guys, it's Super Boo 3.、Uh, today we are going to be looking at Vegeta's moveset and we're fighting against Freezer on the planet Namek. So I thought I might as well just keep all Dragon Ball thing. Just for the sake of it, I put Goku as my support. Okay, so Vegeta's moveset is pretty strange because we got a weak attack combo, but he doesn't have a strong attack combo here.、Um, he has a typical guard break, but as you notice, the R1 square is not mentioned here either. Uh, he's got a dash and he can actually fly through the air as well and combo while dashing. Double jump.、Um, again, his jumping attacks get very complicated here with triangle button presses available. You can go Super Saiyan.、Uh, I doubt it gives you a damage buff. It's probably just visual.、Uh, he's got an energy blast, volley, big bang attack, and explosive wave. And his ultimate attack is going to be the final flash.、And、if you look at special actions, this explains what happened with the R1 square. And he can mix in the triangle button with that as well. So let's、uh, test him out. Whoa. That's your R1 square. And when you do the triangle from a distance, that's with the R1 triangle, it does that as well. That's his dashing combo there. Which works on the ground and in mid air, which is nice to see. That finger beam attack seems to have a decent range. Oh, okay. And that explains why his, key, his second jump attack is just doing energy blast in the air. And I guess they had to kind of make the moves like that. The circle button does this. That's with no direction. Whoa. R1 circle, that's the. I think I've pretty forgot the name. Was it final explosion or something? Which has got some knockback on it there because he only hit the edge of that and that knocked him flying. The up in circle does the big bang attack. You can obviously do these from midair as well. Although I've run out of key. I'm just going to go super soon so we can see how that looks. Now we're going to try and go up to Freezer and actually just see what his basic combos are. That's the square string. And when you chuck and try and go, it knocks him back. Oh, his combo potential is pretty lousy because you can't even launch him.、Um, I will say I'm not exactly impressed with his moveset here. I would have expected someone who's、uh, proud saying, as he always would tell you,、um, would have had some better moves, but he has like, very little co close combat moves. And his long distance doesn't seem to be doing as much damage out of. Hoped either. That's the holding triangle. Game not too impressive. That's R1 triangle. And the camera looks absolutely horrible while underwater, so let's just get out of here. Yeah, I've got to say, he's got one of the worst moves that I've seen in the game yet.、Um, I can see him being very irritating if you want to play long range, but not having much combat options and punches and kicks when all of his moves look so similar. He's really not talking about one 
want an interesting character here at all. That's his taunt. So it's going to be to do that. I'm just going to wail on Freezer a bit more until I can unlock his... Um... What's that called? Uh, arm attack and burst mode. I've got a feeling that Freezer's probably going to be just as lame. Because the thing is, Freezer would probably be more interesting if he could transform, but he's already in his transform state. Oh, I actually forgot I had brought uh, Goku along with me. Okay, that's really powerful move. And I'll be honest, I like that. Let's try it again. Let's see it properly when it's not underwater. Yeah, that's insanely powerful. I honestly don't think I've been fighting good enough to deserve to win this fight, but I honestly think Freezer's seem kind of lousy. And completely unimpressive, so I think that's made a big difference here. Yeah, we won that fight anyway. The two on two fights go a lot quicker than that, which is how come uh, the five minute time limit was actually more than enough to actually beat the other team. Because obviously, there's two people to knock out, you knock them out a lot quicker. Um, anyway guys, uh, well we got to explore Vegeta's moveset, um, I'm not sure who we'll be looking at next time, but if you have any suggestions do feel free to leave a comment in the comment section or just uh, notify me in one of the threads that I run. Okay, anyway guys, until next time, bye.